Hello viewers, in this video we are going to see how you can delete multiple records with Ajax in Laravel 8. In last video about this Laravel Ajax CRUD topic, we have seen how to delete single record with Ajax and everything worked fine. Today we are going to implement multiple deletions with Ajax by using checkboxes. Let's add checkboxes column here and delete all button here. Back to countries list blade file and add this main input checkbox here. Then back to countries controller and add new column in this get countries list method. Let's rename this column as checkbox. Here we will return input checkbox with data ID attribute of each country ID. For displaying checkbox as it is, we have to add this checkbox on this raw columns array. Back to data table initialization and add checkbox column. Let's test. As you can see, we have now our main checkbox and country checkbox on every country. Let's add delete all button here. As you can see, we have now delete all button on this table. When we check and uncheck this main checkbox, you see that the server processing. Even on this button, if we click on it, you see that the server processing. How to prevent ordering data when we click on delete all button and main checkbox. Back to data table initialization and set orderable and searchable options to false on first and fourth columns. Let's test. As you can see, if I click on this main checkbox, the server not processing. Also if I click on this delete all button, the server not processing. How to check this main checkbox and select all checkboxes on current page. And when we uncheck this, then unselect all checkboxes on current page. Just add this jQuery scripts for main checkbox here. If this main input checkbox is checked, then check all checkboxes on current page. Otherwise, uncheck all checkboxes on current page. Let's test. If I check on this main checkbox, as you can see, all checkboxes on this page are checked, and if uncheck this main checkbox, you see that all checkboxes on this page are unchecked as well.
Now, let's check main input checkbox when all checkboxes on current page are checked. Let's test. As you can see, if we all check boxes on this page are checked the main input check box become checked. And if one of them became unchecked, the main input check box became unchecked. Let's add this class to this button because we need this button displayed none initially. As you can see, that button is hidden now. Then give this ID attribute to this button. Let's add this function here to toggle delete all button. If at least one of country checkbox is checked, then displays delete all button. Otherwise, hide this button if there is no one checkbox is checked. Then add this function inside these two functions. Let's test. If we check this main input checkbox, you see that the delete all button displayed with text that shows you how many countries are selected. And if we check an individual country checkbox, we can see how many countries are selected. And if no one input checkbox checked, that button will be hidden. Let's reset this main checkbox state to unchecked state and delete all button became hidden inside draw event callback function of data table. Uncheck all countries input checkboxes. Uncheck main input checkbox.
and high delete all button. As you can see, if we change page, the all previous checked input checkboxes became unchecked. Let's make this button to delete all selected countries. Define all checked countries as array. Then push selected countries IDs into this array. Let's see if we can get all selected countries IDs. As you can see, we can get all selected countries IDs when we click on delete all button. Let's continue. Add new post route for deleting all selected countries. Then copy this root name. then using it on this URL variable. We will use sweet alert to confirm selected countries deletion. Let's add delete selected countries method inside countries controller class.
If selected countries deleted successfully, return success message. This method will delete all selected countries. Let's test. Let's select these two countries. If I click on this delete button, this sweet alert modal will pop up. If I click on cancel button, nothing will happen. But if I click on yes delete button, the selected countries deleted from database. Let's delete other countries. Now, let's delete all remain countries. As you can see, all countries have been deleted. Friends, this is how you can delete multiple records with Ajax in Laravel 8. Thanks for watching this video.